In this video I'm going to show you how to place a bet uh, below minimum and I know videos have been done on this before uh, but there are several uh, queries that we get uh, on bet angel for example on how, how does it bet below the minimum um, and how is that possible when the minimum bet is a certain value so minimum bet is two pound uh, four euros and six dollars I think uh, off the top of my head I may be wrong but I think that's what the minimum is uh, but the way that uh, bet angel does this is is the following. Say I want to place a 1p uh, back bet on Arsenal. Um, what I do first of all is I go in, I'm going to place a bet, but I'm not going to place it at 266, I'm going to place it at odds of 1000. And we'll place that bet, and that's gone into the market. But um, the situation now is that will never get matched at 1000. Uh, certainly not before the start of the match. But if I go in and I modify that to two pound and a penny and update it, then what Betfair does is it creates two bets in the market. So you can see we've got one bet here at odds of a thousand and one bet here at odds of a thousand um, for a penny and one for two pound. So you can see here we've actually created a bet for one penny. So if I now modify that back to the current back price on Arsenal and click on update, then um, what we actually have here is a bet of a penny on Arsenal. We have placed a bet of 1p on Arsenal. And when you're using Bet Angel, this is effectively what Bet Angel has to do. So when we're placing bets for odd amounts or very small amounts, it has to go in, modify um, the bet um, several times to get it back to odd amounts. And we do this just to make positions tidy. So if you're betting or trading on small stakes, then bet engine will modify the bet to get it under the minimum. But what I what I should say to you is, you know, don't do this as standard. Don't abuse um, this uh, process because the minimum bet on Betfair is two pound or whatever it is in your local currency, um, and you will get your wrist severely slapped if you keep on placing bets for a penny. Uh, but if you want to round off a position, green up, modify elements of a bet, and that's part of the process then that's probably okay, but just don't abuse it. Um, but that's how you place a, a one penny bet on the back side. Now for the lay side, it's a little bit different. Um, so if I go in, we're gonna lay the draw for a penny. We're gonna increase our liability on the draw. Um, let's just go back to our open bets here. There we go. So if I want to lay for a penny, we have to follow a different process. And that process um, is sort of similar, but at different prices. So if I go into the draw now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to lay the draw for two pound, but instead of doing it at a thousand, which would be madness, because it's available at a much lower price, I'm going to lay the draw at 101, and I'm going to place that bet into the market. So there, you can see we've got a bet um, for two pound at 101. So if again, if I go in and modify that two pound and a penny and update it, then what Betfair does is it splits the two and then I can modify the bet for a penny back up to 345, which is the current lay price. And then I have laid the draw for a penny. If we go to open bets, I'll just get rid of the, the one that we don't want. And you'll see that I now have two bets in here one we backed at 226 on Arsenal and then we laid the draw for a penny at 345 and that is how you place a bet below minimum bet angel when you use bet angel does this automatically for you it works out if you're below the minimum and then modifies the bet to be able to do this um, but for example um, we you can't do that in Excel because we don't want um, it to be abused and Betfair indicated strongly to us uh, that they will clamp down on any abuse but this is a good explanation of, of how to place uh, very small bets uh, below minimum on Betfair. Hope that was useful for you. So I'll give you a view here on how BetAngel does subminimum betting. It's, it's really simple. In fact, there are several ways in which this manifests itself. If I um, go to the Dutching area and I say I want to back with a stake of a penny, uh, what I can do is I can select, I don't know, let's, let's select the outside of here, Red Gift. Um, and you can see here total stake a penny. And if I do place bets, then uh, it will place a bet for us for a penny. So if we look at match bets, you can see that's what it's done.
I'll repeat it actually because you couldn't quite see what's happening at the bottom of the screen here. Um, but if I go in and do this again, you'll see the bet modification process take place down here. So we've got it all set up for a penny there. And if you watch the unmatched bet area, if I bring this up, you can see it going through that bet modification process. Uh, the other way in which um, this will manifest itself is if we're actively trading on a market, I'm going to trade with the £2 here. Um, I'm going to click the Make Market button. It'll put two orders into the market. So that will generate a small profit if both those bets get matched. We just need our bet at 8.2 to get matched. This event will start in five Somebody minutes. please take that. Five I know minutes. you want to. Mwah. Thank you. So we now have a, uh, a profit um, on this market of 40p, but we have to uh, green up that profit. So it would basically spread that 40p across the market, and that's going to be a sub-minimum bet. Um, you can't do that. Um, so you can see here we've backed at 8.2, we've laid at 8. And if I now um, perform the green out function here to give us our profit across the entire field, I'm going to click on this column and you'll see whoop, something happened at the bottom there. And if we go to match bets, you can see that um, it's actually placed a bet, I've got to work it out myself here, on Huntsman's Close, uh, a lay bet at 8.2 for 5p. So you can see minimum bet is £2, but it's gone in and greened up for you. Uh, using a stake much less of that. And BetAngel does it automatically. BetAngel can see um, that that is a smaller value um, and will automatically perform that functionality for you. What you can't do though is, is go in and bet straight off um, with below subminimum because automating that is the, the root of all problems and will get your wrist slapped uh, tremendously by Betfair. Um, but that's how um, that's been implemented in BetAngel seen the process and how it's done and BetAngel will do it automatically for you. If you're interested in learning more about BetAngel, its tools and the opportunities they present, why not visit BetAngel.com today to download a free trial.